Welcome to Sun, Moon, and Stars Intuitive. I am Oracle of the Ether, and I'll be doing a Twin Flame Karmic Connection reading for the collective. This is actually a two-part reading. The other part is Twin Flame Connection or Twin Flame Vibe. So the first part, we will be covering Twin Flames with Karmics or Soulmates. I have already pre-shuffled my decks. So I'm going to shuffle them again online. Some parts of this reading may resonate, some parts may not. I ask that you like, comment, and subscribe. Share if you like. We're going to get right into this reading. So this will be Twin Flames in with Karmics or Soulmates at the top. <clears throat> Show me what I need to see. Show me what I need to see. <clears throat> Show me what I need to see. I'm not going to take that, but what is it? New love. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings. Okay. So some of the twin flames are in a new connection. Oh, just one to pop out. You deserve love. You are lovable. Okay, so this feels like um, a rebound type of thing. Show me what I need to see. All right, I'm going to take that one. Okay, and we have you deserve love. You are lovable. And at the bottom of the deck, we have wedding. This situation involves love. I mean, this situation <laughs> involves marriage. So I feel like um, some of you have a uh, connection with someone that is married or you are possibly married. So let's keep it going. I'm getting the feeling of rejection, and I hate to say that. I feel like someone was rejected. Okay. Someone was rejected, and they, due to them being married, and I feel like someone has marriage on the table. So, let's see. Show me what I need to see. The alchemist, the king. Okay. So, enlightenment, benevolent leadership, benefiting those in your charge, and the alchemist, tra transformation of base motives and goals into golden wisdom. Okay. So, this feels very much like a masculine um, type of energy royal and regal this person may be into science okay so I, i'm getting um a doctor for some okay it's crazy and for possibly some may even do uh some type of spell work okay I do pick up that in my reading sometimes. Show me what I need to see for divine masculines with karmics or soulmates. Show me what I need to see. Okay, so Delante uh, <laughs> delights in the arts without having to be a professional alerts you to the danger of becoming super superficial in your pursuits okay some of you now this could be the masculine's energy or your energy whoever is watching this okay um i feel like someone is very much into art and 
I feel like this particular uh, energy might be a person that likes to be in nature, okay, or in the woods, probably surrounding water. And then we have alchemists again showing up. So I feel like this particular masculine energy likes to make things happen, okay? Oh, the martyr, okay, learning the trans the transcendent, transcending, transcending, <laughs> transcending. It's, in the, it's the middle of Mercury, retrograde, okay? So y'all, <laughs> y'all bear with me. Okay, learning the transcending nature of service to oneself or a cause. Okay. Okay, addiction to self-pity. Okay. This is um, very interesting. Let's go ahead and pull from the back. Oh, beggar. Okay. Confronts empowerment at the level of physical survival, awakens the spiritual authority of humility, compassion, and self-esteem. Dependence on others to the exclusion of effort. That is interesting. Okay, I'm I'm feeling I'm feeling like uh, sort of like um, like an and I some like a player energy. I, I feel like someone is definitely um, more concerned with what things look like, the outer appearance. And I may, and that's why I feel like someone was rejected. Okay. Child wound. Awaken compassion and desire to serve other wounded children opens the learning path of forgiveness. Wow. Okay. So this makes sense because a lot of times when you develop a codependent um, energy, rather, if you're a person that is being drained or doing the draining, it tends to uh, stem from our childhood. Oh, why am I shuffling this again? Um, Prince, yeah. Romantic charm and potential for power, using power for self. Aggrandizement? So like a very grand... Um, Grandiose behavior. I'm picking up narcissistic. This person may f have a lot of uh, what is that? A lot of tension. Okay, so let's go ahead and get the last pull before I start breaking these cards down. Show me what I need to see, sir. deck is be flexible so going forward I feel like this particular masculine energy will um, be experiencing some issues where they're going to have to bend obviously in an uncomfortable position so the universe might be placing this masculine in some um, sticky situations okay and then we have expect the best and this is my magnet card, and it's kind of like a, what they call a self-serving prophecy. So you are what you attract. Let's go ahead and see what spirit has to say. Well, you will get what you attract, excuse me. So we have back to basics. Okay, so this is the advice for divine masculine um i feel like i i don't know why i'm 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 getting a growing issues okay so this particular masculine uh, might be having some issues with his private area or his leg okay um i'm seeing uh, the need to eat 
better. All right. And then at the bottom of the deck, we have downtime. Okay. So this is a... Um, this is a tricky card for this particular reading. Uh, I'm feeling like this masculine is getting nowhere fast. Okay, so I, I'm I'm feeling like this masculine energy has been doing the same things, getting the same results, and it's kind of like I'm getting running out of time. Okay, yeah, call on your runners. Um, this is this is talking about um delegate you know getting individuals to do the things that need to be done and that goes to trusting individuals so if this particular masculine is a business owner if you're surrounded by negative people there's no way you can you can get downtime yeah take your time take your time Take your time. All right. Let's go ahead and break this energy down. Divine Masculine. Dealing with karmics or soulmates. right now the energy is very crazy very crazy I'm gonna go ahead and flip these cards over because I do read reversals however if they come out reverse then I will take them okay so, the cards want to jump out my hand. This energy is crazy. All right. You deserve love. Clarify, you deserve love. All right. This one wanted to jump out my hand, but I'm not going to take it. This one actually landed on the table. So, this is definitely a karmic uh, soulmate connection. 